Hello friends, welcome back. My name is Priyandra Kumar and today we will learn how to give a picture effect in your chart. So as you are seeing my screen, I have created two charts for one for sales, quarter wise sales, second for revenue. And I have given this 3D effect uh, and even I have created this floor also. So how can you create this beautiful chart in Microsoft Excel? I'll tell you today. So let's start. So I'm going to the new worksheet, just create new worksheet, in fact two worksheet, first worksheet 4 and 5. So what we will do, we will just copying this data to worksheet 4, copy and go to the sheet 4 and just paste it here. So first of all we will create the simple graph, for that just select quarter and sales and go to the insert and in insert go to the charts and we will select the column chart and the 2d column this one now we will change the design for the chart so go to the chart option and under chart option go to the design and we will take this design which is a style 9 you can take another another design whatever you want so chart is created now we will select the columns and right click go to the add data label and add data label okay so data label added now what we will do we will change the color of each quarter so right click and go to the format data series and go to the fill and line and here select under fill vary colors y point okay now first graph is ready now we will create another graph so just go to the insert first of all select the data quarter and then press control and now we will select the revenue okay go to the insert and here we will select the column chart again so we will create the similar chart even you could have copied this first chart and then change the range so no problem i'm just giving the style 9 and here i will add the data level so we can add the data level from here also okay now we will change the color right click and go to the format data points go to the fill and select vary color y point okay friends so both graphs are ready now what we will do select both graph together press ctrl x cut these graphs and go to the sheet 5 and just paste it here so adjust this column and for second graph we will put from here and we will adjust this column also now we will use camera functionality in these graph so first of all we will enable the camera to enabling the camera we will go to the files and in files we will use the option and the option we will go to the customize ribbon and here we will select popular command and now we will select the command not in ribbon now what we will do here as you are seeing the camera is available now here we will add a new tab and we will go to the camera and right click or you can use the add add so camera is added here now click ok now camera is added here as you are seeing a new tab is available here now what we will do we will select the range of the first graph just like that from a1 to H15 and click on camera 
now go to the seat one and just click here so our first chart is created as a picture now again we will go to the seat 5 now we will select the range from J1 to Q15 and we'll go to the new tab wherein we have added camera and go to the camera click on camera now go to the seat 4 and just click here so revenue graph is also created and these are in picture form so what we will do we will go to the crop option and we will just crop the extra image like this press crop and similarly for the revenue graph just crop this and from bottom press crop so both our graph is ready now what we will do select the first sales graph and go to the format and the format we will select this style okay now what we will do we will right click on this go to the picture format and uh, under picture format we will go to the 3d rotation so here we will change uh, x rotation as 340 and y rotation as 10 degree z rotation also as 10 degree and the perspective as 100 okay friends so this graph is ready and we will make the similar change in the second graph first of all we will go to the picture and select this which is uh, relax perspective right now here we will change uh, the x rotation on second graph we will take x rotation as 20 and y again 10 z is also as 10 and the perspective as 100 okay so now graph is ready click outside so we miss something sorry so for z rotation we will take as 350 right yes okay friends so graph is ready now what we will do we will create the floor so creating the floor we will go to the insert and we'll go to the shapes here we will take this rectangle and from here we just need to drag a rectangle you can take it as much as you want now what we'll do we'll change the color of this rectangle go to the shape fill and here we will take this third gray 20 percent background to darker 50 percent and we'll take the shape outline as no outline now we will click on this floor and just right click and click on send to back so our graph is ready now we will go to the view and we can remove the grid lines headings and now we will go to the picture effect again and we can copy this man and we can use it here So that is how friends you can create this graph with the help of camera now these graph are connected with the this data table if you want to check it you can check let's change yes it's working okay friends so that is how you can use the camera for the charts so i will tell you a few other example how, wherein you can use the camera functionality for the chart i have created another video and so i would like to show that one these dynamic graph with the camera so here i have taken a few graph on hidden seat and with the help of camera i'm displaying the graph here let's say i have 
target service level as 70%. Okay, so if I want to create a graph for these data points, a donut graph, then click on this. Donut graph is ready. And if I want to, if I will change the actual service level as let's say 50%, this donut gra graph will be changed at Z. Okay, so now if I take the speedometer then speedometer will be created thermometer graph then a thermometer will be created so that is how you can create uh, with the help of camera multiple uh, graphs and uh, you know the beautiful vi dashboards so friends uh, i will upload this excel file to my google drive and i will give the link in description and for this uh, graph if you want to learn these graphs then i'm giving the link of video in the description you can watch that video also from there okay friends thank you so much for the watching